You can only fish for stone crab on the southeastern coast of the US, Cuba, the Bahamas, and Mexico. And it's Florida where more stone crabs are caught than anywhere else. Strangely enough, fishers can only harvest the claws from the crabs, while the bodies must be returned to the ocean. The state requires all harvested claws to be at least 2 and 7 eighths inches long. Crabbers can legally break off both claws if they meet the required size. On average, claws can take up to three years to grow large enough to harvest again, which is why the state requires that crabbers pay close attention to each claw's size. But despite the claw's ability to regrow, some researchers have questioned the sustainability of this system. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission found that 46 to 82% of crabs died from the loss of two claws, while 23 to 59% died from the removal of one. That's compared to just 12.8% of crabs that died when no claws were removed. This makes the way these claws are broken all the more important for preserving the fishery's future.